this is three pounds. Hi, Hi guys. So today we're here in Houston, Texas and it's crawfish season. season. So today we're headed to one of our favorite crawfish places here in town, which is LA Crawfish, right there. Mm -hmm. Crawfish is something that's loved by many people in the south in Louisiana and Texas. It's very similar to shrimp in many ways, but it has its own unique flavor. With, it's a little bit more buttery, I'd say, and a little more savory. It does take a little more work to peel the tails off and, and enjoy it, but we love crawfish. Yeah, we do. Yep, and LA Crawfish is one of our favorite spots, mm -hmm. and they do have crawfish in their pho and even in some other dishes. You can also get some other cool things here, like wings, and they do have shrimp as well and other seafood. So we're looking forward to checking it out, kicking yeah. off the 2019 mm -hmm. crawfish, crawfish season. season. Cajun style, Cajun medium, spicy, extra spicy, spicy, spicy. Any potatoes, corn, two each. Yeah. Yeah, two corn and two potatoes each. Any sausage? No sausage for me. All right. So when you get your stuff here, you want to make sure that you get seasoning salt. That's highly recommended in my opinion. You got salt, pepper, cayenne pepper, and then you also got the butter down here. Self service. Get what you need. Here too. <laughs> we got the crawfish here. First thing, make sure you got everything on. <laughs> Don't wear white, otherwise it's gonna be the last time you wear that. This is three pounds. And then we did two corn and two potatoes for each of us. It's really hot. Some people say, oh, you need to shake it up and all that, and I don't know, I'm just not into that. It's already pretty well cooked and seasoned, I've seen. We got the corns, where's our potatoes? There's the potatoes. The size of these things are pretty good. Some seasons are better than others, but there's been some bad seasons as well. So that's your crawfish. For those of you that have never had this before, looks like a mini lobster. What you're after is the tail. So the first thing you do is you grab it by the mid torso there, tear off that tail part and that's all the goodness here so how do you get to that you ask you peel it from one side I don't know if you can see that put your finger underneath this ridge and I just peel to the side until I have a good amount of meat showing and I pull it right out and that's goodness here you want that that's flavor right there all right first I'll try it without the spice just to know what I'm working with mm. Flavorful, spicy. We went with the, the medium spicy, not all the way up. We have done the all the way up spicy and it's a little intense, so you'll be crying if you're not ready for it. Another thing people do, if you wanna take it a step further, you can suck the head out. This, the juice is behind the head. What you do is in the hole here, pull it apart. This is not anything you wanna eat unless you wanna go after the claws. Sometimes they're big enough to do that. Otherwise, you've got this meat right here and people just like to eat that. Really flavorful too. And then of course you got the corn and potatoes in between. They are really spicy, whoa. Finishing up here, it's like the table is a mess. Six pounds of crawfish later. I'd say we did pretty well. That's the crawfish pho, and it's like pieces of crawfish in there, like bits of sausage, onions, bean sprouts, jalapeno, that looks really good. It started off originally in 99 Ranch Road in Blaylock. This is the second store here, and now they franchise, they have like seven stores now. So it's Houston based. It's Houston based, so yeah. yeah, so far. You know, we want to go around everywhere else, but uh, not yet, not, not at the moment. It's Vietnamese style? Yeah, it's like Vietnamese, Cajun right. influence seafood. Okay. So, you know, we try to have a little bit of the Louisiana flavor, Definitely. but it has like the Vietnamese kick to it. And you guys have crawfish all year round? All year round. So, whenever it's not the season, it's frozen crawfish. Okay. Or whenever it's the season, 
frozen is live proper. And even out of season, the yes. frozen ones taste yes. really good. It's so pretty good. It's all about the seasoning and the way we make the flavor and stuff. Right. Yeah. How can you tell when it's going to be a good good year versus a, a not so good year on the crawfish? Maybe I think like the winter, if the okay. winter is long or if the winter is short. Gotcha. Because right now we're still waiting on the winter. They're all pretty small at the moment. So it's getting hotter, you'll still be like a line out the door right, 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 right. now. It'll take like 20 minutes just to sit in here. Man. You know? I'm glad we got so, our crawfish. Yeah. Yeah, 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 it's, it's the perfect now. time right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I appreciate it, man. Hey guys, so we just finished up here at LA Crawfish and we are full. Yeah, but it was delicious. It was six pounds later, you know. The uh, table looked a little bit like a war zone after. Yeah, absolutely, but, uh, absolutely. But it was amazing. You know, be sure to try some of the different things they have. They have wings, they have pho with crawfish, they have all kinds of cool things. Yeah. And then I know that one thing we didn't get this time because was, I was full and she was full, the beignets. They have these beignets which are basically a Cajun style donut and they taste amazing. They put powdered sugar. If you remember from our first videos we did in New Orleans, yeah. that was where we went to Cafe du Monde. Cafe du Monde. We went to Cafe yes. du Monde and had those beignets. This is a very similar style, like, like David said, this is kind of a Vietnamese Cajun style crawfish. You might find a franchise near you very soon. So with that said, we'll see you on the next one. See you on the next one. Bye. Bye.